Thanks for staying with us. Now on to the world of sport. This one story is going to get you thinking. What comes to mind when one thinks of the games? Billiards and snooker. A slick white collar game, right? Well, that's all in the past now. Today we tell you that just about anyone can pursue these games, no matter what background they're from or how much money you have, especially in the state of Tamil Nadu. Take a look. Big names like Pankaj Adwani, Geet Sethi or Vidya Pillai set the bar for any rookie snook. Yes, that's the level of aspiration for many junior players who thought they couldn't stand a chance. It's boys like Peter Paul, the state's number one player, who aspire to make the real impact. I won the junior and junior title. I won the game in the game. I stopped the 10th standard and stopped the study. I won the snooker sports court and I won the railway slayer. Isn't that proof enough that the sport carries with it a symbol of being any man's game? But these youngsters relish a platform for opportunity that's approachable and affordable. People from any background can actually come and uh, afford this game. Um, we have uh, clubs like YMCA who just take a, a, just a few rupees to actually play for many hours. It gets even better in Tamil Nadu. Just 400 rupees and you've got a cue stick in hand to pot those colours for an entire month. And better yet, even if you're just a local marker, your name could feature in the state's rankings if you strive for it. Saturday Sunday vandi school school mostly Saturday Sunday vandi practice panna povan. Appo vandu solluvanga nalla aadra. Nee vandu association series state match first yaar na kattan naalu. First Nanda na Nanda na master aur master Nanda Nanda vandu panna re enak. Meri aalare na kas kettara naalu. Saw setare. Oita association vandu team vise vandu setara. However, if it weren't for the state association kick-starting the sub-junior category in the first place, Peter and Sundar would never have tasted success of this kind. People used to think that it is a rich man's game or white-collar game. It is not like that. Now, anybody can uh, afford to play. I introduced this first time in Indian national uh, tournament, billiards and snooker, sub-junior category. You know, that is the age when really this game can, uh, you can pick up that game. As they say, get them going when they're young. In Chennai, Natasha Doraiswamy for NDTV Hindu. On to cricket now and the ICC released its all-time Test 11 and as many as four Indians feature in the list. Well, what makes it even more special is the fact that the list is based on votes by cricket fans from all over the world. Here is the fans' choice of India's awesome foursome. Vrinder Sehwag, Sunil Gavaskar, Sachin Tendulkar and Kapil Dev taking up four spots in the Dream 11 for Tests. Apart from the four Indians, there are four Australians, including spin king Shane Warne. Surprisingly, the two West Indians are Courtly Ambrose and Brian Lara. There is just Wasim Akram from Pakistan. The nations that miss out are South Africa, England, Sri Lanka and New Zealand. For certain, Sir Garfield Sobers would count himself very unlucky to have missed out on that list. But then again, it goes on to show the demographics of the voters who clearly never had the chance to see the likes of Malcolm Marshall, Sir Jack Hobbs or Dennis Lilly play. No wonder then that the ICC was on the defensive, stating that this team has been picked by the fans. They had voted on the ICC website, picking from a shortlist put up by Cricket's governing body. I, I don't agree with your notion that it takes away uh, credibility or the ICC should not be behaving in that fashion. Selection is a judgment call. Um, it's the opinion of selectors and this was a group that we put together or, or, or a voting process that we put together. Um, it proves the kind of interest that exists for the game. Many will question the omission of legends like Muthaya Murli Tharan, Viv Richards and Ian Botham. But the ICC's intentions were only to commemorate the 2000th Test match with such activities. The Test starts at Lord's on Thursday with India taking on England. With Nikhil Nas and Jedi Bhandarkar in London, in New Delhi, Amitot Singh for NETV. And the ICC is also going all out in promoting the test format of the game. And the latest move on that front could be a timeless test. That's right, ICC CEO uh, Harun Lorgat has suggested that the final of the inaugural World Test Championship in England in 2013 could be a timeless test. The world body is considering the option as it would ensure a clear winner so that one team wins outright. You either determine a winner or will the draw be the, the end result? That's something that's through work in progress. I would favour a winner because you'd want somebody to be the test champion. Well, that's it from me and the sports world. Back to you, Evelyn, for all the masala from the world of entertainment. Thank you.
Thanks very much indeed. Now, Tamil cinema is beginning to have more and more faith in multi star casts, and on the cards is a Jeeva and Jayam Ravi movie to be directed by S.P. Jananandan. Our entertainment reporter Lalit Jude brings you more on the 3J factor. <laughs> Filmmaker S.P. Jananathan may be soft-spoken, but his films are hardly the candy floss kind. And the national award-winning director is now opting for a new combination, both in script and cast. Jayam Ravi is a part of the Jeeva. Sir, Jayam Ravi Jeeva is a subject in the Jeeva. Sir, I will tell you about it. Sir, I will tell you about it. 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 All of them are chemistry. 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 They are understanding. They are product. They are cast up. They are cast up. What does Jeeva, who swept the audience with his natural performance as a photojournalist in Co, have to say about this combo meal? We've been all uh, like uh, friends for, la for the last uh, almost seven to eight years. If working with Ravi, I, I don't think so we would have any... Uh, you know, ego clashes or something. So very friendly, and he's a very hard, uh, uh, a very light-hearted uh, friend. We know Jananathan touches on socially relevant issues. Will his upcoming film touch upon politics as well, or will it be about two heroes, one good and the other bad? Yeah, script to Jananathan point na ne kire dena. And hero achi na business point na ne kire dena. Ella, the one the yar ka kam promiso, sena da yuruk ko tapan achi ko na yuruk ko. Jiwa tak panas, jam berapa? Jika jam berapa panas, jika jiwa itu, apa ini dah boleh? Yang namanya nak hilang, awang orang gaya hilang, tapi macam mana? Awang orang itu putih kaitik hilang. Can real life friends be best buddies on screen, as it happens in Bollywood? That's the question. In Chennai, with reporter Lalit Jude, Kuku Alex for NDTV Hindu. Well, the virtual world has been abuzz with scribbles on even the filmy flavour. Let's now track today's writing on the wall. Well, today's pick is that of Bosky Balasubramanian, who says Deva Tirumagal has been nominated for the Best Child Artist Award category, but the panel is confused whether it should go to Sarah or Vikram. Well, quite some interesting food for thought there by Bosky. That's the news tonight, but we continue to track the top stories right here on NDTV.